I know why you're here. It was 3 a.m. as usual and you got a brand new idea after a two-hour session in Pinterest. I need a glow up. And you know what? You found my video, so I'm happy to help. and welcome back on my youtube channel so in this video we're going to talk about how to glow up in 24 hours i know almost everyone thinks that that is actually impossible but i did my best surfing the internet finding some guides tips and tricks for you so yeah i know it's like um uh, july already but you know who cares because we still have the global pandemic and we have some time to glow up okay anyway let's get into it Oh, and also I forgot to say, like, grab your coffee, tea, and enjoy my video. Step one is light skincare. I've seen this step literally in every single video or guide I went through, and I decided also to include it in my video. Um, what I suggest personally is to use Korean Cosmetics, or if you literally need the fastest glow ever, still use Korean Cosmetics, or my favorite things from Ordinary. It's not sponsored because I have like five subscribers, so it's not sponsored. <laughs> Step two is makeup. And please girls, don't get me wrong here because I don't mean that you're not beautiful and you have to put tons of makeup. No, 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 that is not correct. Um, I was just thinking if you're tired of your makeup you're wearing, you can change your style a bit or you get some aesthetic makeup from Pinterest and it got play up inspirations for you here. Take a look. I have tried various types of makeup and I realized that I need this one. This one is probably the most light as possible. Some glitter, eyeliner, and foundation, and that's it. Because I used to uh, have this kind of makeup, you know, kind of monskin, monskin type. That's what I call it. Okay, so step three is outfit. If you don't have uh, some money for getting like clothes from Forever 21 or H&M, that is totally okay. You can create, you know, a brand new look from already existing clothes that you have in your wardrobe. But you can also go thrift shopping. I heard this option because take a look. These are my favorite thrift shops ever in Canada. And just go there. Um, it's um, 12 a.m. here and I'm editing the video. I don't like the why. I presented the third step about outfits, so I want to apologize. <laughs> We'll fix this probably in the next video. Step four is hairstyle. And I need to warn you here. Don't you ever dye your hair without sleeping with this thought or dyeing your hair pink like I did. And you know, uh, getting a bob haircut like I did. So, um, I highly recommend just to go on Pinterest, look something like 80s hairstyles, 90s hairstyles, and just stick to it. Um, because I regret it almost every single thing I do with my hair. And right now, I'm having my blonde hair. I probably dyed it like nine times. Uh, and, you know, I haven't come in like four, three years. And I'm happy about it. So that was it, guys. I know that this video was extremely short, but you know what? I can make a part two and also I want to make before and after. So if this video is going to get some views, I'm probably going to make part two. Thank you so much for being here with me. Don't forget to write a comment down below, give a thumbs up. And yeah, I also have some social media, so if you don't mind, you can just visit it, take a glimpse. And thank you so much again, and see you next week.